Bloodbiz DMS is a web-based document management system that is completely responsive. This means that you can use Lutbiz DMS using any device connected to the internet, computer, or mobile, without downloading any mobile apps. Lutbiz DMS is completely customizable and can be customized to meet the unique needs of our customers. Lutbiz DMS comes in two flavors, Basic and Enterprise. The Basic version of Lutbiz DMS allows you to store and retrieve documents and their different versions in document tagging. It also includes document categories and communication and provides the complete audit trail of all the documents. The Enterprise version of Lutbiz DMS supports document workflow with an electronic signature in addition to all the basic features. You can get your documents approved digitally without any manual intervention. Additionally, there is a view user module of Lutbiz DMS that can be plugged into both the basic and enterprise version. This view user module allows you to share documents with users for viewing and communicating either forever or till a selected date. This is the login screen of the software. Once we log in, we see that all six modules of Lutbiz along with the admin module open up. In Lutbiz there is just one admin user. This user, John happens to be the admin user. So, he can use the admin module. First, let me walk you through the admin module. Once you click on the admin icon on the main dashboard, you see the dashboard of the admin module. The admin can do the configuration work like setting the password aging policy, creating your different business locations, and creating the DMS users and the DMS groups. Lutbiz is extremely easy to use. To add anything to the system, let's say, you want to add a business location or company, click on the link companies in the left hand navigation bar. You will see this screen with a red button on top that you can click to add a company. You will see the add company form that is divided into two sections, green and blue. The green section is always at the top and is mandatory while the optional blue section is below. Once you fill out the form and hit the submit button below, the company will be added to your system. Similarly, you can add DMS users and DMS groups to the system. A word about DMS groups. In Lutbiz DMS, users can be divided into groups. Groups can be around departments, projects, or locations. However, each group should have a group leader who will create folders and templates and give access privileges to the group users. The admin can easily manage the group users by clicking on the link, Manage Users, against the name of each group. A person can be a leader or member or a combination of both of any number of groups, there is no limit on that. Additionally, the admin can set the rules for document retention, alert emails, and document expiry settings. The document expiry feature of Lutbiz DMS allows you to set a future alert date on a document so that you get notified about it. The document does not expire on that date. It's just an alert date. The admin can configure how many months prior to the expiry date should the stakeholders be notified on their dashboard as well as via email. Similarly, the admin can set the number of days for which documents need to be retained in a group before it reaches the end of life and can be deleted by the group leader. The system sends out various email alerts for document related activities. The admin can control the activities for which email alerts need to be sent to the users. That's it, the admin module is very straightforward to use. Next, let us move on to the DMS module. In Lutbiz, moving from one module to another is pretty simple. You click on the home icon on the top right. You will see the drop down list of modules to which you have access. Click on DMS module. You will be able to see the dashboard of the DMS module of Lutbiz. A couple of unique features of Lutbiz DMS are that the system has audio and video guides on every screen and all links that you require to use the system are available right from the dashboard. Of course, those links are also available on the left hand navigation menu. The dashboard has a quick graphical snapshot of your DMS usage as well as links to the various alerts that are generated for you by the system. The group leader can create folders and give access privileges to the group members. There are four different access privileges to the folders, namely, upload, 
view, modify, and full. The users with upload privileges can only upload and view documents in that folder while the users with view privileges can only view documents in that folder. The users with modify privileges can modify, approve, and upload later versions of the documents while the users with full privileges can upload, view, and modify documents in that folder. Now that a folder has been created, let us upload documents into that folder. You can upload documents either using the links on the dashboard or the links in the left-hand navigation menu. You can upload multiple documents in any format using this option, scan documents using this option, or folders using this option. For scan documents, LookBiz DMS has a built-in OCR functionality that reads through the content of the document and makes it completely searchable. Let us try to upload a couple of documents using this option. Once you click on the Documents button, you will see this screen where you need to select the folder where you would like to upload the document. Then go to the next step, browse and upload your documents and hit the Submit button. That's it. You are done. The document has been uploaded to LookBiz DMS and you can view it either by clicking on the List link on the dashboard or the List Documents link in the left-hand navigation menu. Either way, you will see the list of documents to which you have access. You can then click on the eye icon to view the document or click on the name of the document in the list to view the document detail screen that has complete details about the document. You can view the document from the document detail page with its timestamp dotted trail. You can also tag it, edit it, rename it, hide it, or download it to make corrections if you have permission to do so. You can share documents with your view users by clicking on this button in the document detail screen. You can share these documents either forever or till a particular date. Let's share this document with Kate for the next two days. The moment you do so, Kate will receive an email that informs her that John has shared a document with her. She can then log into her LookBiz DMS which looks a lot simpler than John's. She can view the document by clicking here. If she has a question about the document, she can ask John by posting her question by clicking on this button. She can type out her question and once she hits the submit button, John will receive an email that will inform him about Kate's question. He can then log into the system and view Kate's question and also answer it. This communication will always be available to John even after Kate's access to the document has expired and John can always refer back to it. This feature helps in managing all communication about the document centrally. LookBiz DMS allows you to have discussions with the other users of your document by using the discussion forum feature attached to each document. These discussion forums are completely searchable and you can retrieve the discussion threads at any time. This is especially helpful during employee attrition. The searchable discussion forum works as a knowledge base for the company where all the discussion about the document is stored. The group leaders in LookBiz DMS can create document tagging templates that are metadata templates that can be attached to documents for searching them easily. By the way, LookBiz DMS has a lot of advanced search options including full text search through the content of documents. You can also have discussions around the uploaded documents and LookBiz DMS allows you to search through those discussions too. Isn't that awesome? LookBiz DMS has a built-in version control mechanism that helps in managing all the versions of your documents centrally. This is the version control box for this particular document. As you can see that the download button is active and the upload button is inactive. Once John clicks on the download button, the document is downloaded to his hard disk. He can then modify the document offline and once he is ready to upload it back to the system, he can do so by clicking on this upload button. Until John uploads the document back to the system, the other users who have either modify or full privilege to the folder for making corrections cannot do so. Once John uploads the document back to the system, the others will be able to download it and make further modifications based on their access privilege. After John has uploaded the document to the system, the system appended a v2 to its name. So this is now the active version of the document that you can view by clicking here. Version 1 of the document has now been moved down to history along with its audit trail. You can have as many numbers of versions of a document as you want. 
Out of these, one will be the active version and the rest will be moved to history along with their audit trail. John as a group leader can also lock the version control for this document by clicking here. Once it is locked, no more changes can be made to the document. However, for John, the lock button will toggle to unlock. He can click on the unlock button to make the version control for that document work again. You can also roll back a document to a previous version by clicking here. Another interesting feature of Lookbiz DMS Enterprise is document approval and workflow with an electronic signature. For configuring the electronic signature, the user has to click on the password link on the top navigation bar and then click on signature password. On this screen, the user has to upload his or her signature image and protect it with a signature password. Once this is done, the user is now ready to approve documents. In Lookbiz DMS Enterprise, there are two types of approvals, single step and multiple step approvals. In single step approval, the user sends the document to another user for approval. In multiple step approval with multiple approvers, the group leader configures the workflow process in advance. The group leader can define the workflow process with any number of steps and then publish it. Once published, the group members can use the workflow process to get their documents approved. In both the approval processes, whenever a document is sent for approval, the approver gets notified via email as well as receives a notification on their dashboard. The approver can click on the name of the document on their dashboard and view the document detail screen where the document can be viewed. The approver can then either approve or reject the document and use their electronic signature during the approval. The sender of the document is notified via email as well as on their dashboard about the approval. An approved workflow document can then be shared with the other users of the group. These users will be able to access the document based on their access to the folder where the document is located. Lookbiz DMS also generates a lot of reports that give you useful insight into the usage of the system. All these reports can be exported to CSV, Excel, or PDF formats and can also be printed out. You can also search inside these reports and drill them down till you reach the document that you are looking for. That's it guys. I believe that now you have a pretty good idea of how Lookbiz DMS works. If you would like to have a live demo with one of our executives or if you have some questions, please write to us at sales at lewatinfotech.com. We are always happy to answer your questions and help you out. We look forward to hearing from you soon and to implementing Lookbiz DMS in your organization. Thank you.